Hi everyone, how are you doing? This is Martin and welcome back to The Lone Dark where we continue the story for the survival training of Jeremiah. I had a comment last video about this shed and suddenly it dawned to me what it is. It's a freaking toilet. <laughs> Nothing more. Alright, see if we can hunt some rabbits and I need some rosebuds and when I have that we're going to have back to Jeremiah. Hand in the quest and continue and... Oh, that's a big branch. And then we'll see what happens. At some point, we have to get out of here and hunt that bear. Oh, gotcha. Sorry, buddy. Alright, like before, if you don't like this, please look away. There you go. Alright, job done. Is there any more? Oh, there's another rabbit over here. I'll grab him as well. Because I am hungry. Mackenzie is starving. Oh, he's seen me. A little bugger. Alright, let's see if we can sneak up to him like this. Watch me miss. Where is he? Oh. <laughs> that was cheating, Mr. Rabbit. Alright, look away. Or not. Alright, that will do. Sorry, Mr. Rabbit. Let's go this way. Um, I have a feeling I am going. So, I will spend the night over here somewhere. There was the little cabin. I'm going to go over here. Try my luck, see if there's any rosebuds. Grab some sticks for along the way. Maybe I need a quick fire. We'll see. See if there's anything more to explore over here. Oh, there's sort of lumber going on. So there might definitely be something. It's um, it's pretty grey weather, and there's a l start to snow, and I hope there will be no storm or. I am pretty screwed. Last time there was this major fog and I couldn't see a thing. Oh shit, what's that? Clear cut! Alright, so we there is a new location and I'm really really hungry. There's not much I can do and yeah, it's the weather is turning. What is this? Is that some kind of a lookout? There's a big arrow saying that away. Might as well give it a try. If there's a big stormer coming, um, we can spend a, at least some hours in a lookout shelter. That would be really great. It is still early morning, so... Got a bit of time. My hands. Let's see. I don't know, man, about the snow. I'm just waiting for the storm to come. Alright, so... Oh! Oh, hello. Mmm. So I take all the meat? Or I could make a f fire? And def I don't have that much wood on me. I, I, I need... Screw the guts. One hour twenty-five. Hopefully. Uh oh, please no storm. Okay, that's good. That is good. We're stinking. <laughs> All right, excellent. We need to eat soon, though. I'm gonna have to leave something behind. No, no, no. Oh, hang on. We can make a fire. Let's do that. Um, yeah. Alright. We got a fire. Let's make a big one. Alright. It's all the way to the top. It's full. Rancid meat. It probably was there for a long time. But it was frozen. And we have to eat something. So let's cook all the meat. Make a coffee as well. That would be good. Keep me warm. Alright, let's cook all the four chucks. 
Four chunks of meat? I think I have. Yeah, one more. 12% man, ooh. Gamey wolf meat, hmm. Delish. Alright, I think I have to hurry it up. Oh shit, I can't do that. Um, add a bit more of this. Just, just don't push it, just melt a liter of water. Make a coffee, this should be enough to keep me going. Yeah, I guess so. Alright, um, coffee. Oh, of course. Can I? Oh, there you go. I think that goes faster. Nice. Alright, now then. I should make a cup of coffee. There we go. Alright, luck changed. Nice. Let's eat. If it gives us anything. Yeah, well, what gives a little bit? That will do. Oh, that would do. That would do just nicely. We're cold though, but we can fix that. I drink a cup of coffee right now. First the coffee. Get the buff. Warm up and we get the reduced fatigue. There we go. Alright, now that tower. Well, actually... No, screw it. I should have enough water and... I also be heading back to either to the camp office or to Mackenzie. Let's see what's up here. I didn't know there were two lookouts. There was only shown one on the map. Ooh, that's that's a big long way down. Sad music. Hmm. But there Oh shit. Oh it's a destroyed lookout. Alright. Oh what's this here? Look look look. Some reclaimed wood, pork and beans. Nice. Swinket, flare, cloth. More wood. Don't really have to make a fire right now. That's a plank I don't need. Can we go to this tower? There's nothing really here. There's a big chest over there. Same as in Milton. Or at least I hope there were loot the, lots of goodies in there. Come on. Could end up being useful. I see. Let me guess how we go down. Alright. Oh, there's more loot. Nice. Very nice. Uh, oh, look! Oh, shit. I'm glad I came here. Yeah. Um, but that rope is really heavy. Now, these stones were also in Milton, so I'm going to guess. Yeah. There we go. Hopefully, I'm not over encumbered. No. Alright, let's go down. Sweet! Oh, I like that. We'll have a look on the map where the here it is. I don't know. And I have no clue where I am, but... This looks very inviting to go this way, so let's do that. We are... we are here. I don't know where I came down. We have to go this way. These rocks drawn on the map, they're curious. At least to say curious. Alright, so we have got all sorts of buffs going. I think I will just follow this and see what happens. <sighs> it's a sight for sore eyes. Um, it was pretty linear. After all, and I, I'm glad I took that road down after repel down and just went that direction. And there we are. I found this old house, the broken down house that I recognized as well. That was a good point of reference. But um, yeah, did pretty good in time. We're thinking like there's no tomorrow. Who did he bury all? 
I don't know, I would like to have this know the story about this. Let's first dump the quest stuff in here. Alright, so we have let's see. Um probably it's right here. Alright. We need to give him eight of these. I think eight of these or maybe four. Well I just put eight in because I have enough. And all of these. And then these. What that do? It does. It does. All right. Let's go in. Cool. No cutting. All right. Let's have a word. Huh. Not bad for a pilot. Yeah. Well. Thanks for the help. I think I'm ready to get out of here. I have a little graduation present for you. Ooh, oh, yeah. nice. Here. Well. Thanks. You've earned it. And I have a feeling you're going to be needing it before you're through. I have a feeling you might be right. Hmm. Oh, he gained some trust. You have to talk with him again. Look. I appreciate your help in learning how to survive out here. I really do. But my friend is still out there. And they may need my help. It's time I got going. Like I said before, Mackenzie. There's only one way out of here. Through that dam. Okay. So, how do I get through it then? I'm the only one who can get you through. And I want to help you, I really do. I'm tired of being jerked around, Jeremiah. I need to get out of here. Listen, Mackenzie. There's more at stake here than you realize. This is about more than you, or me, or your friend. What are you talking about? Just... Listen, if you can't get past the bear, the rest doesn't matter. If I was well enough, I'd take care of it myself, but I'm wrecked. We'll die here unless you finish it off. I'm a pilot with a bit of survival training. I'm not an experienced hunter. What can I do? You can pull a trigger, can't you? Well, yeah. Get out there. Keep your wits about you. He's out there, waiting. But you're going to have to bait him, so the fight can happen on your terms. What? Bait him? With what? Bears can smell blood from over 20 clicks away. You get out there, cut yourself enough that you bleed, and he'll come to you. I'm sure of it. So, you want me to use myself as bait? There's no way I'm doing this. This is crazy. He'll come for you when you're not expecting it. But you won't miss it. It won't be subtle. It'll sound like a ton of muscle and bone bearing down on you like a freight train of hate and hunger. You stand your ground. Do not flinch. You raise your rifle, you sight him, and when you can see between his eyes, you squeeze that trigger. Oh boy. It's the only way. And if I make it? How will I know when it's done? He won't go down with one shot. He'll run off, and it'll seem like you got him, but he'll be back. He always comes back. You do it again, and again, as many times as it takes to bring him down. This sounds like suicide. Only if you fail. You sure this is the only way? You bring me the old bear's ear, and I'll get you out of here. I will give you everything you need to find your friend. Okay. Well, you better hope this works. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Or I'll be sending the old bear back for you. Ah! Remember, Mackenzie. Wait till you see the whites of his eyes. Then squeeze the trigger. I understand. It's not something you can understand with your head, Mackenzie. No man can know if he has what it takes to face the bear until he's faced it. And then, it's not about what's in here. It's about what you've got in here. You aren't going to kill the bear with your head. You're going to kill him with your heart.
Oh, damn. We are doing it. Tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to prepare. We have... Do we have his gun? He took it. Let's see. No. Oh shit, my gun is outside. All right, well, we'll grab, we'll grab that one. Um, we will do that in the next episode. For now, thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you tomorrow and we'll continue and start hunting some bear. Yeah. Till then, have a great day. Bye.